Hi everybody, I want to welcome you to your Tabata pump workout for today. What we need is a barbell, but if you don't have the right barbell at your disposal, you can use a pair of dumbbells for this workout as well. Now we're going to follow Tabata's method of exercise by creating a short circuit of eight exercises with only 10 seconds rest in between. I hope you guys enjoy this workout. Let's get into it with exercise one. Squats and good morning complex for this exercise. Isometric side squat with one bent knee and a straight knee. Have the bar rested on your thigh. Zerka squat, holding the bar with the inside of your elbows and keeping it nice and tight against your body. Drop into a deep sumo squat and work your prances from there. deadlift and calves raise complex for this exercise. Suitcase squat, one set holding the bar with your right hand and another set holding it with your left.
step back into alternating lengthy lunges with the bar resting on the back of your neck. Power clean by deadlifting all the way down and then throwing the bar all the way up to your collarbone. Alright guys, you've gotten through the first round and discovered your eight exercises for today. We've got three more rounds to go. Let's do this. Squats and good morning complex for this exercise. Isometric side squat with one bent knee and a straight knee. Have the bar rested on your thigh. Zerka squat, holding the bar with the inside of your elbows and keeping it nice and tight against your body. Drop into a deep sumo squat and work your prances from there.
deadlift and calves raise complex for this exercise. Suitcase squat, one set holding the bar with your right hand and another set holding it with your left. Step back into alternating lengthy lunges with the bar resting on the back of your neck. clean by deadlifting all the way down and then throwing the bar all the way up to your collarbone. Two rounds down and two rounds to go guys. Let's keep up the good work and let's keep training. Squats and good morning complex for this exercise. Isometric side squat with one bent knee and a straight knee, have the bar rested on your thigh.
berserker squat, holding the bar with the inside of your elbows and keeping it nice and tight against your body. Drop into a deep sumo squat and work your prances from there. deadlift and calves raise complex for this exercise. Suitcase squat, one set holding the bar with your right hand and another set holding it with your left. Step back into alternating lengthy lunges with the bar resting on the back of your neck. clean by deadlifting all the way down and then throwing the bar all the way up to your collarbone. You're smashing your workout guys. Three rounds down, we got one more to go. Let's keep going. Squats and good morning complex for this exercise.
isometric side squat with one bent knee and a straight knee. Have the bar rested on your thigh. Zerka squat, holding the bar with the inside of your elbows and keeping it nice and tight against your body. Drop into a deep sumo squat and work your prances from there. Deadlift and calves raise complex for this exercise. Suitcase squat, one set holding the bar with your right hand and another set holding it with your left. Step back into alternating lengthy lunges with the bar resting on the back of your neck.
power clean by deadlifting all the way down and then throwing the bar all the way up to your collarbone. Well done for getting through your Tabata workout for today, you guys. Now I'm going to hand things over to Daphne, who's going to work on some static post-workout stretching with you. Stand upright and bend one leg back, grabbing the top of that foot. Bring your foot as close to your butt as possible, while keeping your knees close together. Tuck your pelvis and pull your foot back even more for a deepened stretch. Hold onto a wall for balance. Now let's do the quadriceps stretch with the other leg. Start on your hands and knees, have your hands directly under your shoulders and your knees below your hips. Lift your knees off the ground and press your chest towards your thigh. Try to straighten your legs completely and lower your heels to the floor. You can alternate with bending one knee and pressing the opposite heel into the ground to stretch each leg individually. Ensure your abdominals are engaged and have your shoulders away from your ears. Hold for 30 seconds. Start in a high kneeling position. Take a big step forward with your right leg. Shift your weight forward until your right knee is directly over your ankle joint. Draw your abs to tuck your pelvis and feel the stretch in the right front side of your pelvis. Hold for 30 seconds. Now let's repeat the psoas and hip flexor stretch on the other leg. Start in four-point kneeling, widen your knees more and extend your right leg straight out to the side. You should feel a stretch in your right hip adductor. To intensify the stretch, try going down on your forearms and shift your weight slightly back. Hold for 30 seconds.
Now let's do the hip adductor and groin stretch with the other leg. Sitting cross-legged, bring your left leg behind you, straighten your spine and rotate your upper body to your right. You should feel stretch in the left front side of your thigh. Let's repeat the sartorius stretch with the other leg. Great job, well done for finishing your workout today. Now guys, make sure you click here and subscribe to this channel so that you can get more workouts anytime you like. If you hit the join icon and join us as a member, then you'll get access to days 11 to 30 of every workout series as well. See you soon.